I've always um, been told by my grandmother how important it is to vote and how people before me, a lot of people, um, older people in my family did not have that right. So what I loved most um, about my job were the older voters. The older voters like to call, they like to talk to you, they like to get my card, they like to know that every election I'm here. When, when I saw the video, of course, the first thing that I said was like, why, what, why, is, why are they doing this? What's going on? And um, they you know, just told me that Trump and his allies were not satisfied with the outcome of the election, and they, they were getting a lot of threats and um, being harassed online and asked me, you know, have I been receiving anything and I need to check on my mom? So I'm just asking him, like, well, where are the messages? All I see is the feeds, like, how do you get to the messages? And he said, it's another icon on your phone that says Messenger. And I went to that icon and a, a lot of threats, um, wishing death upon me, um, telling me that you know, I'm, I'll be in jail with my mother and saying things like, be glad it's 2020 and not 1920. For my entire professional life, I was Lady Ruby. My community in Georgia, where I was born and lived my whole life, knew me as Lady Ruby. I built my own business around that name, La Ruby's Unique Treasures. Now I won't even introduce myself by my name anymore. I get nervous when I bump into someone I know in the grocery store who says my name. I'm worried about who's listening. I get nervous when I have to give my name for food orders. I'm always concerned of who's around me. I've lost my name and I've lost my reputation. I've lost my sense of security. All because a group of people starting with number 45 and his ally, Rudy Giuliani, decided to scapegoat me and my daughter, Shay to push their own lies about how the presidential election was stolen. Ms. Moss, how has this experience of being targeted by the former president and his allies affected your life? It's turned my life upside down. Um, I no longer give out my business card. I don't transfer calls. I, um, don't want anyone knowing my name. I don't want to go anywhere with my mom because she might yell my name out over the grocery aisle or something. I don't go to the grocery store at all. I haven't been anywhere um, at all. I've gained about 60 pounds. I just don't do nothing anymore. I don't want to go anywhere. I second guess everything that I do. Um, affect my life in a, in a major way, in every way, all because of lies. For me doing my job, same thing I've been doing forever.